guys, I'm gonna show you today how I achieved this look in my Christmas planner where I am documenting my days in December with my family. And it's more of a vintage look inspired by, um, I'm using this journal of ours from Designs by Planner Perfect. Um, and I've been using Tim Holtz Vintage Ephemera, and so it was just very fitting. I love to put and draw movies in that we've, we see. Um, this was something that just by doing Toy Story and Woody was something that we watched with my grandson. And how I just go about prepping my pages before um, all ahead of time so that it makes it easy when it comes to journaling. So, um, I added tabs and some ephemera. Sometimes I leave a page completely. This one is even like really dark. I'm gonna just like a picture or completely writing all around it and journaling. Um, so I'm gonna show you how I do it. So this is from Prima Marketing. I love using Starbucks shot glasses for my water. Um, and this is just one of our journals. And here's one of the pages I did just in my uh, live not too long ago, but I'm gonna just leave it up on here. And all I do is I take a really nice dark brown and do the whole page. I usually like to do the outskirts so that they have a really nice tarnished look. Get in the edges. You kind of have to work, you know, fairly quick. Um, but yet it doesn't matter because even if you can't, if it's dried a little and you can't get it to bleed out, like right here is what I mean, where it kind of then that's fine too. It all just has such a great look. I know there's a lot of different ways you can vintage out or give a tarnished look to your pages, but this is just how my brain works and what I always have paints out. So this is just what, how I do it. And doing this kind of prep work ahead of time gets you inspired to make sure that you document your life. You can do that as dark or as light as you want. I like that a lot. I love using tabs too, kind of like Christmas day 20, you know. Anything else you'd like to see from me, just leave it in the comments. You can try to do more little videos to inspire you to not only just write a better story for your life, but take a proactive approach, which is writing a better story. And writing out your desires and how you want your life to be. And that's exactly what you'll attract to you. Writing down God's best for your life. Not just what life is presenting to you, but what you desire it to be.
So there is kind of my my vintage look. You can use one of those little air dryers to help get it dry. And um, now you can kind of add even the way that looks just looks so cute adding some more water and then like pushing it to the edges really helps but letting it be messy and letting it look you know it's funny how we perceive if something doesn't look like it's perfect or something that it's wrong but i actually have a different way of looking at it if something is off center or looks stark or looks different or lonely then to me it's how it should be so a little bit of a mind shift and all is well enjoy painting in your journals girls